Hello everyone, welcome back again to Mufatsuke channel with GW3D Modeling Basic Tutorial Part 3 How to Create a Canatol Join and Assembly First, uh, I will create a new part Okay, you can use a uh, template in millimeter The next, uh, I will uh, use a uh, sketch uh, tools and we can choose a uh, red plan You can click OK I will use a uh, draw command, we can draw a simple to this cat. Okay, I will draw Take uh, this form. The next, uh, I will uh, create uh, arts command, arts object with uh, this command. Okay, you can click from this point into here. Okay, and then I will set for reduce into 30. You can click OK. Now uh, we can use a quick dimension. We can give a dimension into this line objects into 120. Okay, in uh, this object uh, into 15 and for this line object uh, 45 next uh, from this point into here we can set into 7,5 okay now uh, you can give uh, distance from uh, these uh, two line objects into 30 and you can click OK I will uh, create line. Okay, you can click sketch and use a line command. You can create line stuff on this point. I will move into here. And now I will use a uh, power trim to cut these uh, objects. Okay, these lines objects. We cut again in here and the last in it. You can uh, use a fillet command. Okay, I will fillet with a radius 3. You can click at uh, these uh, objects and in here. Okay, we fill again at uh, this point. You can close this uh, sketch uh, editing. Okay, now uh, to convert into 3D models, so uh, we can use a revolve command. You can click a revolve, and I will select this profile. For axis, we can select uh, this uh, lens objects. Okay, this for axis, and you can click OK to so apply this uh, revolve command. Now we can save uh, this object, so you can click here save And I will uh, set in here Okay, part 3 You can click save You can close uh, these uh, drawings And to assembly, I will open the last object so I will open this uh, canonical join part 2 It will be open The next to insert into here another uh, part you can right click and then you can use insert component okay i will uh, use browse and you can insert part one okay you can click okay the next uh, we can insert again okay you can click here and i will insert part three you can click at this point you can click okay to apply Okay, uh, sorry, uh, we need uh, to active uh, this command, copy part, and you can click OK. okay. Now, uh, to combine these uh, all objects, uh, we can use assembly tools. You can click here assembly, and now I will use a uh, command constraint. First, I will select in here, okay, in this uh, circle, and you also can select at this point. Okay, it will be moved, and you can click OK. You also can select these objects and move into here. So it will be assembly between these two objects. For this object, so we can select from this point. Okay, and now we can click in here. It will be moved. And you can click apply. You can select this object and move into here. Okay, now you can click OK. And if all objects are already assembly, you can move into here or you can move into this point. Okay, very easy to create uh, this uh, 3D model canonical join part 3 and then assembly with uh, the other objects part 1, part 2, and then part 3. Okay, enough today for GW3D basic uh, tutorial how to create a uh, canonical join. If you have any question about this uh, tutorial, you can comment below this video.